Hey y'all, hey, it's Lisa and welcome to this week's plan with me. We are going to be planning for the week of October 29th through November 4th. We are using this kit right here from Lexi Kali Designs. This is called Wicked, y'all. And I love this kit. I think it is one of my favorites. I think it's, you know, out of all of my Halloween kits, I think I love this one most of all, y'all. Now, the washi we are going to be using this week, y'all, are from a uh, Michael's Recollections tube. These three are from uh, one tube uh, that I purchased last year. And this right here is from the Singles uh, Washi basket that they usually have. I purchased this last year, but it was in a package by itself. Or maybe it had one more piece in it. Anyhow, guys, it's all from Michaels this week. I'm not going to be putting any Simply Gilded Washi in here. Even though I do have a purple that would match this, but it's gold. And then I have an orange, that, but I don't think it's going to match this orange. But that is what we are going to be working with today, y'all. We do have two new subscribers. Now, I am not sure if these subscribers are planner subscribers or are they subscribers because they like my radon hauls y'all but anyhow we do have two more ladies joining us today we have Carla Wyatt and Yari N Thank you guys so much for joining me if you are watching this planner video and if you only watch my Ray Dunn videos then you might not see this. <laughs> Anyhow guys, we are going to get started with this plan with me so let's jump into it. Okay guys, I am going to start by placing down this bottom washi right here, well not bottom washi but this washi from the Michaels Recollections too. Uh, I like this because it says Happy Halloween and I want to place this down here first. I kind of already cut up the washi and it is a hot mess. I for whatever reason cannot cut washi y'all. It is so crazy that I cannot cut up washi. And I used my little cutting board from um, from uh, Michaels, and I still did not cut the washi straight. <laughs> I'm like, oh my god, are you kidding me? How can I mess up washi, y'all? But it's all right. It'll be all right. There we go. I think it'll look. It'll still look pretty. So. It'll be alright. Okay guys, I got that piece down, so let's see what this is going to look like. Well, at least I got the sizing of it down, <laughs> right? It don't look too bad, even though I chopped it up all kind of crazy. There we go. This washi was really pretty too. I liked it so much. There we go. And let's get the smaller piece down. The smaller piece may be just a tiny bit bigger than the other side, but that's all right. There we go. All right, I like that. Now just to give this a little bit more sparkle, I did bring out my little hearts this week to place down just to uh, give this kid a little sparkle, a little bit more sparkle. Even though I'm covering up the little uh, sparkles here. I'm not going to do all of them. I'll just do a few of them. So I hope everybody has had a wonderful week. My week was okay. I didn't do too well on my done hunting this week, y'all. 
I have already posted my little haul video so you guys should have already seen it if you watch those videos it has been a crazy week y'all I have heard stories you know sometimes I get to the store early and uh, some ladies are up there and they are telling me all kind of stories and uh, on my Thursday morning run y'all is so funny there was a guy at the store he got to the store you know around nine o'clock when they opened the doors and he actually was in the store before us y'all and he was looking for Ray Dunn so like I said he was in the store before us so he could have grabbed as much as he wanted to y'all but he did not know what he was looking for. He couldn't find it. So when we went in there, we went straight to it. So we grabbed, you know, what they had in the store. So he had found some kind of dog bowl or something else. And um, I left because I only purchased one uh, bowl that day. So I had got in line and I, you know, checked out and paid. And I was heading my way on down to Marshall's. So when the other lady got to Marshall, she was like, that guy was so mad. He was on the phone talking to his wife, telling his wife that we had took everything. And <laughs> y'all, they say he was so mad. And I'm like, well, I don't know why he was so mad. He beat us in the store. So he could have, you know, cleaned everything out by the time we made it in there. Because there are two sides, there are two doors to the store, you guys know, when it's a home good and TJ Maxx. One side is TJ Maxx, one side is home good. So he went into the side, the TJ Maxx side, and they opened that door first. So that's how he managed to beat us in the store. So, but yeah, it's been a week, y'all. So, how are we going to disperse these boxes? I know I'm going to put the double boxes over here. And then, let's see, we have a printed and a purple. We have dark. Okay, so we started with dark, purple, dark, purple, dark. Alright, got it how I want to do it, y'all. So... Let's start with this purple right here. And I am just going to place these down in my little zigzag pattern. And I know I have a double box there, like I said. And I usually, when I usually do double boxes, I usually put them all in a row like this. But I am not going to be doing that today. I think I'm going to do something a little bit different, y'all. So, but yeah guys uh, then I went to do a done run on Saturday morning because I can only do Saturdays and actually I did a early morning run on Wednesday as well because we didn't have very many patients oh yeah that's what it was that guy he came on Wednesday and then on Thursday y'all the manager in that the manager that was on duty that day she did not put the items out uh, like she was supposed to they supposed to put the items out in the morning at that particular marshal so that uh, they can get it out of the way the, the manager says she likes to put it out early so she can just get it out the way but this particular manager did not do it that day she waited till we came into the store y'all and she put it out about an hour after we left. And I know this because I told you guys my done buddy, her daughter works in the store. So she called her mom and she was like, uh, yeah, she put everything out after you guys left. She put it out ar around uh, 10, 1030 or 11 o'clock, she said. And, and they had those... Um, red belief plates out that day and that is what I wanted I wanted a red belief plate and I still am looking for a red canister but I think I have a solution to that so I'm not going to tell you guys I am just going to let you guys wait and see but anyhow 
we didn't get anything on Thursday, <laughs> which was really upsetting. And then on Friday, that same manager was in the store. Oh, you know what? I have extra boxes and I didn't even realize that. So, I'm just going to leave it like that, you guys. Uh, what was I saying? Oh, yeah. On Friday, that same manager was there in the store. So, my dun buddy, she can go on Fridays. So, she didn't want to go that day because she felt like the manager was going to do the same thing. So, she went ahead and she had gone to work. But, no, guys. No. She put it out. She put it out that morning. <laughs> and my dun buddy had gone to work. She was so mad. I was like, that lady is, I don't know. I hear stories about managers and, and them hiding stuff in the back and not putting this. And it came to reality uh, last week, y'all. It came to reality. So, for the last two boxes, guys, I'm, I'm, I am going to put those down up at the top. And I am going to do something that my uh, friend from Anna Planner's, uh, Anna underscore Planner does. But I need to put my weekend washi banner down first. So, I am going to be using these glitter headers this week. Uh, because they are the uh, glitter, real glitter headers, guys. And I know that she has glitter headers in the kit. And I normally like to use... All of the items that are in the kit. Where are those glitter headers at? I should have four pages to this. Am I overlooking it? Okay. Anyhow, guys. <laughs> There are glitter headers that come with this kit, but I don't want to use those. I want to use the real glitter headers. And then for the date covers, you guys, I am going to be using these right here from ColourPop Paper. They are not foil. They are just plain black and white headers. I have already placed the dates. So, you guys know what that means. I will return in two minutes and two seconds. Okay guys, now that we have all of the bits and bubbles done, we can get started with the date today. 
Now, I'm just going to go ahead and jump into it, y'all. <laughs> I am going to start by placing work. And this week, I am using these flags right here from Clever Girl Crafts. And I am just going to be taking the darker shade here, this black shade. And I'm just going to go ahead and place down our work situation for this week. So I am going to be placing the flags down. And I am going to be using the same work script that I used last week. These right here from a Golden Planner Shop. I'm going to be placing these down. Alright guys, now that we have marked work, I can go ahead and zoom us in to Monday. Alright guys, the first thing I want to mark on Monday is that I was super excited about finding my red cups on my Radon run. We got off super early for lunch on Monday and I managed to go around to a few stores. So yeah, I was super excited y'all. So I'm going to take this Hey Girl mug off of this uh, Nikki Plant sampler from Rose Colored Days and I am just going to place that in the box over here. It is quite large, y'all. I might not be able to do that. <laughs> it is quite big. Yeah. Oh, you know what I can do? Hold on one sec. Uh, it's stuck on my... Okay, never mind. <laughs> we just going to keep that right there, okay? But I wanted to put one of my little excited... Uh, Sunnies from Wild Sunshine. You know, I think I still might put it in there. It might look cray cray, but hey, I was excited, y'all. No, oh, no, I think it looks fine. I don't have to write anything in there because I know what that means. So, yeah. That is how I am starting my Monday. That might look crazy to some, but it is all right with me. <laughs> so, moving on, guys. I needed to make a return to the UPS store and for that I am going to be taking one of these little quarter boxes and let's take let's take the stripe one here and then she has a bunch of cute little icons in her uh, kit so I will be trying to use up as many of her icons as I can this week y'all and she has this little car right here that I can put down for returning that package to the UPS office or the FedEx, I mean UPS drop off, whatever you want to call it. You guys know what I mean. So I'm just going to stick that right there. And I do want to put one of my little foiled little stars on there. So let's place this one here. These things run out so fast. If you use these uh, all the time, these things will run out very quickly because they are so small and you don't get very many on a sheet. Now I do watch uh, Amalia from Two Little Bees and she uses, these, she uses these all over her planner and I'm like... I know I buy a lot of stickers, y'all, but I can't afford that. <laughs> I cannot afford it, y'all. Now, the next thing I want to mark is that I had a video to go live on this day. Now, this was a little sampler sheet that she uh, sent with this kit. So, I want to use this uh, little uh, quarter box from the sampler sheet and I'm just going to place that there and to mark my video going up this week y'all I am using this sheet right here from Magic Prints Co. I'm just using the little play, button, play buttons from this sheet and I will be using the film buttons as well. Now the last thing I want to mark on um, Monday 
is oh that's it right that is it guys that is it for Monday but I do want to put something in this space right here so let's see if we can find some washi and I do want to put this uh, real pretty washi right here from Michaels I think this is one of my favorite washies from Michaels that I have ever purchased from there if I can find the little pull off section but you know you can only use this so often with the colors in this washi alright y'all moving on to Tuesday the first thing I want to mark is that it was recycle week so I am just going to take this little label right here and I'm just going to place it right here to mark recycle and I will be using one of her stickers because these are super cute and they are very functional y'all so I'm gonna just take this and I'm going to place it over here like so to mark recycle and the next thing I want to mark is that I needed to order a new prescription so I don't think she has anything like that for uh, prescriptions on here so oh yeah she does she has a cell phone so I'm gonna take this cell phone and I am going to place it on a have I mean not a half box on a quarter box we don't need to put that on a half box <laughs> that'll be way too big so let's just take this pattern quarter box here and I am going to mark that I needed to order a new prescription and she has like I said the cell phone so I'm just going to take the cell phone to mark down making that call like that alright next I want to mark that I did my nails on Tuesday so I'm just going to take a piece of the washi right here and I'm going to cut it down just a wee bit just so it won't go over too much. So I'm going to use my scissors this time. <laughs> this is probably probably not going to come out straight, but we shall see. It'll be all right. There we go. And like I said, it's not straight, <laughs> but that's okay. I'm going to put it down here anyway. So we're just going to put that little piece of washi and then she has a nail polish, nail polish uh, sticker in here and I'm just going to place that down for doing my nails on Tuesday. Now the last thing I want to mark on Tuesday is that I did plant in my B6 so I'm going to take a half box right here and I am just going to place that down. And I have these little stickers, guys. They came with one of my um, sticker kits. And this one right here, I'm going to take this little ghost right here. Uh, this is an Erin Condren planner. <laughs> but this little ghost is so cute. And I want to use her. I'm going to be using quite a few of them. But we're going to place her down for planning that day. That's so cute. There we go. And then I'm going to place a skinny piece of washi right in there. If I have a skinny piece. I do. I have a little piece right over here. It's a very skinny piece too. It might not even do any good. Oh yeah, it's cute. I like it. Just what I need it. Okay, and now we can move on to Wednesday, which was hot day, hot day, hot day. And it was also Halloween. So I am going to be bringing in the scallop box right here from Panda Bird Designs. I am going to turn it downwards like so and 
and I am going to be taking my holiday stickers from you know who, Clava Gal, not Clava Gal, <laughs> Rose Color Days in the silver colorway, and we are going to be placing down this happy Halloween. You guys, it rained here all day on Halloween, so any trick-or-treaters at all, not a one. Which was very, very sad. We bought so much candy and now all of that candy is just sitting in the living room. You know, we've been picking off of it a little bit, but I've been living in this house for over 20 something years and we have always had trick-or-treaters. Oh my gosh, I tore that sticker up and now I can't find the rest of it so I can do some sticker surgery. That's why I say these stickers are so... Thin. Oh my gosh, that just tore right on up. Let me see if it's going to look right, guys. Let me see if I can put this Y back together. You know what? That's going to work for me. I'm not going to even <laughs> worry about it. These stickers cost too much money to be wasting, especially these foil stickers. They cost too much money, y'all. So, let's see if I can find something to put over here just to judge it up a little bit. And this little butterfly over here is perfect. We'll just put that little butterfly going out of the corner right there. And you know what? I'm going to take this little trick-or-treat sticker as well. And I'm just going to place it right in the center of this box. Just to give this box a little something. Something. And there we go. I can actually put in this little skeleton as well. But I'll pass for now. So since we have something in this box, we can add a little foil sticker here as well. Let's just put it right here at the end of the treat sticker right there. Now, I do want to fill up some space right here. So I am going to take this piece of washi. No, let me cut this piece of washi right here. There we go. Now, moving on. On Wednesday, I did do some laundry. So, I am going to take one of her laundry stickers. And I'm going to take this piece of washi right here. And we are just going to put the washi down. And then we'll put the laundry day stick on top of the washi. Y'all know how we do. There we go. Now, moving on. The last thing I want to mark on uh, Wednesday is that I did do a little reading. I am trying to finish up this book that I started reading. And it's just taking me a little bit longer because once I get to reading... Then my mind get to doing something else. <laughs> and y'all, I just be all over the place. <laughs> when it's time for me to relax, I'm like, oh. But I'm halfway done with the book, so. I should be done with it this weekend, actually. So, to mark reading, I'm just going to take this uh, little ghost right here with the candle just to mark that I was relaxing and reading. And I'm gonna I'm not gonna cover up that bottle because I think that's really really cute and it'll just be part of the deco. So let's just place our ghost there and we'll put in reading there. Sorry guys, sorry I'm not straight. And we can move on to Thursday, y'all. Now, you know the first thing I want to mark on Thursday is that it was <laughs> November 1st. 
So I don't have another purple uh, scalloped box. So I'm just going to take this silver one right here since we are using silver foil stickers today. And I'm just going to place that there. And then we are going to place our Hello November sticker. Now I hope I don't tear this one like I did just a few minutes ago. And we are going to just place it right here. I want to place it right there because I want to place that other little sticker on here. And which one was it? Oh no, it was on my other sheet. This little skeleton, but I don't think it's going to fit. Yeah, I don't think it's going to fit. So let's just take this little one right here. And let's just place it here. Yeah. Like that. Alright. Moving on. I want to mark down that I I put the laundry away this day and then I um oh I went and voted. So I definitely want to mark down that I voted on this day. So I think for that I'm just gonna take a Oh, let's take this box right here because it's really, really cute. And I'm just going to place that here. And then I'm going to put that I voted here. But I do want to put something in the corner right there. So what should I put there to note down that I voted? I'll take this little uh, bow sticker right here. Even though we have a bow sticker there but I don't want to put this one there because I don't want to put two of the same things there so let's just put this down that to mark down that we voted and we can move on now I did get in a piece of happy mail guys I got in that happy mail that I was trying to explain to you guys it's from a shop called girl boss Anna and it is these washi, clear washies that you place over your uh, boxes. But they are in a strip of a washi. So, I think, I think that explains it. <laughs> but when I do the haul, uh, which I should be doing a haul soon, I will definitely show you guys what I'm talking about but I'm sure if you guys are planner girls and you watch other people's videos you already know what I am talking about so let's place that over here since we put our little bow stick over there let's just put it in there straight so yeah I did get mail from her and then I got a few other pieces of mail that day it was a good mail day because I haven't received happy mail I don't think in a long time so let's place that down and then I want to put down that I put my laundry away that day but I don't have another oh yeah I do have another laundry sticker so let's take let's take our purple little label right here and let's place that this away So guys, I have my window open today uh, to let in some fresh air. So if you guys hear airplanes going by, cars going by, that is because the window is open. And I am just trying to let in a little fresh air. <laughs> the mister is gone today, y'all. He went to New Orleans to watch a football game. So... I took full advantage of opening the windows because I don't know for whatever reason he does not like to open windows and I'm like you are so weird don't you know what fresh air is you gotta have some fresh air coming throughout the house circulating throughout the house so I don't know he just get weirded out every time I open a window and I don't understand what that is about <laughs> But I'm like, I'm letting some fresh air in here, so. That is what I am doing today. 
even though it is a little bit chilly on outside. <laughs> All right, guys, moving on to Friday. Friday was not a very busy day at all, let me tell you. But it was payday, payday. So I do want to mark payday, and I do want to mark that it was Friday. Yeah. So for that, guys, I am just going to be placing those things on some washer. So let's take this piece right here. And we're going to put this finally sticker on here that she has. Her stickers are really, really cute. I really like them. I really like this kit, though. I told you guys it's probably one of my favorite Halloween uh, kits of the year, which I only had. It's not like I had a whole bunch, but... <laughs> This was my favorite one. And let's take this striped piece of a wash yeah. So guys, I did not tell you guys what happened on Saturday when I went to do my um, done run. There was this young lady in there that I had uh, ran across in a Marshalls before. Now I talked to this young lady. I mean, she was talking and she was, you know, saying how you know if she first in line then she should be getting first dibs on the raid done and you know if you come first that you know you should be able to you know get your items and blah 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 and then she was talking about uh how somebody was saying that she needed to share and that I don't know, it was just a weird situation. But anyhow, guys, she was there at the store. But see, I had heard stories uh, from other people about this girl. and But I thought this was a nice girl. I mean, she was so sweet. She was talking, blah, blah, blah. And then I started hearing all these different stories. Because you guys, down here in the Ray Dawn world, it's a short, it's a small world. These girls know each other. They know each other by names. And I'm like, OMG. But anyway, this girl has a reputation of taking her basket and blocking people from getting Ray done. She takes her basket and she just blocks the whole section. And uh, I was like, are you for real? Which I didn't know that, guys, when I was talking to this young lady in uh, Marshalls that day. So I was like, oh, okay. So anyway, Saturday, you know, I got to this more... Uh, home goods like real early me and another lady we we had gotten there real early y'all so we standing in there but it was two sides and you know one side the door opened you know they opened the door in the in um uh, they opened the door to the tj maxx and they opened that door early just like the guy did the guy guy got in there early but these girls were standing on the side that we were standing on but they noticed that the, they had opened that door to the TJ Maxx side. So they go running over there to the TJ Maxx side, guys. And they running in the store. And, you know, it wasn't that many items in that store that day. But with whatever items was in that store, guys, they ran in and they took them. And I was like, wow, this is crazy. <laughs> so I was like. That kind of put a little, uh, I don't know, how should I say, like, it makes it very frustrating for people who have been waiting and people who are new to, to radon hunting. And when you come across things like that, it's like, OMG, do I really want to keep doing this or should I just stay with one store and, um, you know, try to see if I can get things over there. You know, you try, I, I was trying to do different stores to see if different stores had different things, you know. But I'm like, I don't know, guys. I don't know. So that was my experience with her. Her, her name is Lindsay. And if you guys are on Instagram, if you Google Ray Dunn Lindsay, you will see all of the things that she be getting in her cart. It's crazy. It's it's insane. But y'all Google her. Her name is Ray Dunn Lindsay. Google her, y'all, and see what I'm talking about, okay?
<laughs> just Google her. Now, the next thing I want to mark you guys is that I went to the grocery store. So I'm just going to take her grocery sticker. And let what happened to my boxes, y'all. See, y'all know when I get to talking, I get to lose and stuff. And <laughs> not finding stuff. <laughs> it's crazy. But we are almost done with this plan with me, y'all. Even though this has been a rough one today. Things have not been turning out right. And uh, I don't know what is going on. Saturday night, we did not have date night because the mister was driving to New Orleans to meet up with his brother-in-law and his uncle. So, I'm just going to take this movie night sticker because I just kind of chilled and, you know, watched some movies and all of that good stuff. And then I want to take one of these stickers and put it on this grocery basket too. I did place another order for from Tassel Planners. She had a sale. So I was like, let me take advantage and let me get some of these little stickers. <laughs> I got some of the little bows because I think they're so cute. All right, guys. On Sunday, I want to mark that. I am planning. I want to mark that I did a Target run. So this box right here is for planning, and I am going to be taking, let me move all this stuff out of y'all's way, this uh, sort of like an Erin Condren um, box or a planner, and I'm going to be placing, I'm just going to place it over here because this is pretty much the same thing. You guys know I, I forgot, uh, I didn't even realize that I had these balloons over here. I could have placed them here, or I could have placed them up here. Let's place them up here. <laughs> I thought I had a piece of some deco. Do I want to place that there? Yeah, I want to place that here just to give it some color. And then I'm going to remove that bow sticker from there. Yeah, I like that better. So now i got to put this sticker back somewhere. <laughs> I don't know what's going on with my little stickers over here. They are not staying down here. All right, guys. Now, the last thing I want to mark on Sunday is that I did my target run. So, let's take... I have a few more. I think I did really, really good for spreading these boxes out. So let's take our quarter box and then I'm going to take her little shopping bag, bags, because I did get some things out of Target. I have been getting things from the Target Bullseye section, y'all, to, uh, you know, decorate for Christmas. And I cannot wait to decorate for Christmas, guys, because I have been collecting my Ray Dunn stuff. I'm getting so excited about, you know, putting it up, and I don't know, I can't wait. I was looking for another little skinny piece of washi so I could put here. So, Alright guys, that is going to be it for this plan with me this week. I am going to open this planner up so we can take a look. Alright guys, here is the spread all opened up. I want to place a few more of these little foiled hearts here. Just to, you know, kind of give the other little boxes some sparkle. Let's put one over here. A little bat. And then let's place another one on this side let's put it in his little wing here give that a little foiling 
Oh, let's give the little bottle a piece of well too over here. There we go. Let's see. Oh, there we go. Oh, look at that, y'all. Look at that. Falling. So <laughs> All right, guys, there we go. There is the little foil willow. How cute is this spread, you guys, for Halloween? It's so cute. I loved how this turned out. Y'all, this has been a rough plan with me today. I don't know what is going on. But I do want to thank you all so much for joining me. If you stay throughout this whole plan with me thank you guys so so much I do want to thank our new subscribers once again thank you so much for joining me on my YouTube journey and as always guys I hope you are having a great day and or a great week whenever you are viewing this video right here and I will talk to you guys in the next video Bye, y'all.